this ever happened to you? You're reading a comic book, enjoying the contents, and then all of a sudden, ouch, you got yourself a big old paper cut. Not only does it hurt like the dickens, but it could cause you to bleed. Look at all that blood. Oh my goodness. When you finish reading that book, you really enjoyed the story, glad to have it in your collection, and you go to bag and board it. Next thing you know, boom! That comic is no longer in mint condition and you've thrown your back out. Oh, if only there's a way to read comics without messing up your collection. Hi, I'm Brian Wood, and this is Simple Man's Comics. <laughs> no, really guys, hey, I'm about to tell you about a resource, a free resource, where you can read comics online for free, and I'm not talking about some bootleg website, and it's coming up. Hey guys, it's Brian Superman's Comics. If this is your first time on my channel. I do a lot of comic and pop culture related videos. So please click that subscribe button so you'll never miss a future video. A lot of people like to read comics online. A lot of people pay money for Comixology, a bunch of other apps, Marvel subscriptions. But I'm gonna tell you about a free resource where you can look at it on a computer or on cell phones or on a tablet. And I'm talking about an app and website called Hoopla. Hoopla links to your local library. So if you need a library card, local library account. And through that, you can go on the website, log into hoopladigital.com, or you can download the app on your phone or tablet. And there's a bunch of resources on there for you. And it's all free. You can check out up to five books a month. You can watch movies. You can listen to music. I'm telling you, this is one of the best resources, especially when it costs zero money. But enough talking about it. I just want to show you guys a quick demo. So let's hop into the computer and check it out. So we got our web browser open up. We are at hoopladigital.com. It's really easy to sign up for an account. You just click on the get started today and you enter your information in. Confirm your email. Create a password and then confirm the password and click on agree. And then you, from here, you pick your local library. And you can put your library card in and then you just click sign me up and you have an account and it links to your library. I already have a different account signed up. I'll sign into it, click on login and it brings you to your homepage. And this number up here tells you how many titles you have available to still borrow for the month. So if this shows you what titles you currently have borrowed and we can go to browse. Hoopla is great because it's got audiobooks, movies, music. Like if you go to music, it's newer titles, not just old titles. As you can see, it's got the Spider-Verse soundtrack. Great soundtrack, by the way. Moana, Taylor Swift. All types of music that you can check out and listen to. But we will go to comics. And it shows you all types of comics. We'll go into categories. You can go action adventure. You can even search. Let's say um, we want to search Batman. And it brings it up and we'll click on comics. And then it gives you a whole list of Batman comics. And it's all free. It's a link right to your local library. I don't think a lot of people are aware of it, but plenty of times to read. We will go to ebooks, all these Batman ebooks. We'll click on deselect all these other ones. Music, a whole bunch of Batman music, and of course, movies. So it gives you a bunch of different movies there as well. So just show you comics if you check it out online. Um, let's say Old Man Logan, click on borrow, click on borrow here, returns automatically on February 4th. I'll tell you how long you have the book checked out for before it returns automatically. You can recheck it out at that point if you need to, but then you just click on read and you're reading right from your browser. Get to zoom in on the letters if you want, word bubbles. Click the back browser button, takes us right back to the checkout screen. There's a quick demo of the website. Highly recommend you guys check it out. One other thing I wanted to show you is 
the mobile app. So there is a mobile app for Hoopla as well. You can get it on your phone or tablet. I, right here, I have it on my iPad showing. And click the Hula app down at the bottom. And it'll show you titles that I have currently checked out or recently returned. If I go over here and click on books, it has audiobooks, ebooks, comics. I already have it selected as comics because that's what I use it mostly for. And you can browse and see all the different comics they have in here. You can go by popular, recommended, or featured. And then we'll just say, let's say recommended. And say you want to read Thor God of Thunder Volume 2 God Bomb. We'll click on that. We'll click borrow, downloading. Wait a couple of seconds. You can see it processing as it downloads. And then the downloading will switch to read. So now we have the read button and click on read. It says, wait while this title is prepared for offline use. And there we go. We have the book download on our tablet and you just swipe to read. It shows you the different covers and bam, you're in the comic book. So save some money. Don't buy Comixology all the time. Check this resource first. We can click done, close out of that. If you interested also and they have a bunch of different video on here you can watch movies or television i'll click on movies popular you'll see recent movie titles in here it's not just old karate kid and big we'll go to television same as well recommended featured so i got like lego ninjago a bunch of kid titles i got Chappelle show all types huge resource and it is completely free so there it is guys super easy app or website to use Make sure you guys check this out. Get a library card. I think, I don't know if they've changed it, but before you could sign up without a library card, but the amount of resources or the books and titles and everything you could check out was severely limited. So definitely get yourself a library card, link it, get a Hoopla account, make sure, check with your library, make sure it gives you access to their online content because sometimes certain library cards will ask for a pen. And when you go to register in Hoopla, it'll ask for that pen that you created when you got your library card. That's one other thing to check out. Quit spending money and don't use websites that give you a bunch of pop-ups and freaking hog down your resources. And then it dies. Use this app, bunch of great books, bunch of great titles. Use it for movies, use it for music, but definitely check it out. So if you guys are using this app, go and comment down below. Let me know what you guys think about it. Are you using it on your phone? Are you using it on your tablet? Are you using it online? But definitely comment. I'd love to hear from you guys. Click that thumbs up button for me. And if you haven't already done so, please subscribe. This is Brian with Superman's Comics, and I'll see you guys next time.